Hoping for Kenobi. Why are you here? Where the hell is the Kenobi trailer, man? I've been waiting for this thing. I thought we were gonna get it. Yesterday we got those pictures, we got the concept art, which I found out was a freaking leak. And then today we got nothing. And I even saw some glimpses of the sizzle reel, but I didn't watch it fully because I wanted to, you know, have an authentic reaction with you guys. I don't want to be spoiled. But I see it posted everywhere, and it's like, today, obviously they were going to release it. Disney Day, you know. Got nothing. What's going on here? I don't like this. I don't like this. Why do they do this? Uh, G Review says, stay awesome, dude. Thank you, man. Uh, yeah, I don't know what's going on, but we did get something for Boba Fett, I heard. Um, I woke up not too long ago. I have a really weird sleep schedule, as a lot of you know. I sleep at like 5-ish a.m., 5.30. And I usually wake up around like 12 or 1. Um, it's on Disney+, Plus, says Mike. What is... Wait, what? No. The Kenobi sizzle reel is on Disney+. Plus. Get out of here. Let me check this out. Star Wars. Oh, Under the Helmet. No, that's what's on Disney+. Plus. Wait, what is this? Under the Helmet, The Legacy of Boba Fett. A special celebrating the origins and legacy of Star Wars legendary bounty hunter Boba Fett. 21 minutes. Are we watching this together? Uh... Short answer, Disney sucks, <laughs> says Vito. Uh, they wouldn't suck if they just give me the freaking trailer, man. I mean, it was posted around everywhere yesterday, so it's like... Oh, wait, you guys can't see. I guess you can see this now. Um, Under the Helmet, Legacy of Boba Fett on Disney+. Plus. 21 minutes long. Are we doing a watch party? I wasn't expecting to do this, but um, I guess we can watch this. Okay, we'd like to introduce Boba Fett. Can you speak to us, Boba? Certainly. Nice. You didn't know who he was, you didn't know where he came from. But he didn't get much screen time. When he put the costume on and walked onto the set, absolute silence. You said, whoa, who is that? Despite his lack of screen time, next to no dialogue, oh, he's cool. everywhere. The world was ready for this bounty hunter. Under the Helmet, The Legacy of Boba Fett. Now streaming only on Disney+. Plus. Only on Disney+. Plus. Uh, are we watching that? Are we going to watch this? Sizzle Reel is on Disney+. Plus. Search Obi-Wan Kenobi. What the freak? They did release it. They did release it. Well, I eat my words. I bite my tongue. Sizzle reel, though. Why wouldn't they put? Why would they not post this on? What you got? You got to pay in order to see it. Why would they post this on? Uh, StarWars.com or Star Wars? Um... Hmm. Oh well. Um. Hey, Parth, how's it going? Kenobi is also on Disney+. Plus. Hi, Detective Sherlock, is it? Well, it's on Disney+, Plus, titled as Obi-Wan Kenobi First Look. Uh, yeah, Detective Sherlock it is. I think the leak yesterday was what they were going to show today. There was no actual trailer at all. Surprised they didn't strike me. Yeah, my bad, Disney. Yeah, my bad. Well, um, chat, what do you want to do? <laughs> are we watching this together? I was so excited to see the Kenobi trailer today, hopefully soon. Well, I guess it seems like a lot of people are confused, and they didn't know that this is actually here. I mean, just seeing this is... I gotta take my retainer out. I'm like lisping too much. 
can't wait till that thing is out, man. We're good. A behind-the-scenes look at the Obi-Wan Kenobi special event star series starring Ewan McGregor as the iconic Jedi Master. The story begins 10 years after the dramatic events of Star Wars Revenge of the Sith, where Kenobi faced his greatest defeat, the downfall and corruption of his best friend and Jedi apprentice, Anakin Skywalker, turned evil Sith Lord Darth Vader, coming in Disney Plus 2022. A behind-the-scenes look at Obi-Wan Kenobi's special event series starring Ewan McGregor as the iconic Jedi Master. The story begins 10 years after the dramatic events, blah, blah, blah. Kenobi faced his greatest defeat, the downfall. What? Kenobi faced his greatest defeat, the downfall and corruption of his best friend and Jedi apprentice. Yeah, Anakin Skywalker turned evil Sith Lord Darth Vader. That's nuts. I'm just absorbing the fact that this is happening. Um, it's on YouTube? Wait, who, where? Where is it on YouTube? I want to watch it with you guys. I don't want to... I mean, I'll do a watch party if I have to, but uh, I, don't, I don't want to. I'd rather watch it with everybody. Mm. Um, tell me what to do. What do you guys want me to do? What do you guys want to do? It's nothing too special but worth a look. Okay, well, I'm going to play it, and then we can watch the Boba Fett one, I guess. Um... It won't let me, it'll just hit a black screen because it's, they have some encoding in there, but, um, I'm going to go ahead and press play three, two, one. Yeah. See, so it just shows a black screen for you guys. You can't see anything. Holy shit. Dude, I think that's... You know what? It's really weird. It looks like the second sister. I know you can't see. It looks like the second sister in that concept art scene. But, um... I just... I don't know. It doesn't make sense because I thought she was dead. interesting thing is going to be where it goes from there. Holy shit. Well, is that it's brought me back together with Hayden. Oh my god, I can't believe this is happening, dude. Jesus, I'm gonna cry again. Okay. I didn't think that would make me feel like I was, uh... 14 again, 15 again, but it did. It's, it's pretty cool. Imagine when it actually comes out. <laughs> um, you guys could hear it the whole time? What? Uh, you can find it if you look it up. No, I'm not. Dude, I, I won't risk it on, on this channel. I, I don't know. I just feel like they're waiting to to take me down. I feel like they, they, <laughs> they don't want me around. Um, but, uh... I'll react to it on my gaming channel because I don't. It gets deleted, you know, whatever. But, um. Not this channel. That would be a shame. You know, it was really cool seeing Ewan, but then, you know, uh, bringing Hayden in there too. And once they mentioned that, that was. And once you see Hayden, it's like, it's, you know, I wonder how they're going to do it. I wonder if we're going to get flashbacks or, you know, obviously we won't see Hayden under the suit and it's going to be someone else playing in the suit. 
most likely, I assume, but. Wow. It kind of feels like Rogue One, almost like that time, you know, um, when there was like a lot of hype, there was no division. I think that was one of the best times um, as of lately. But anyways, I think Deborah Chow is going to absolutely nail this one. I think she's going to just knock it out of the park and we're going to get probably the best Star Wars that we've gotten in, I think, a long time. And I think the fandom will be very, very uh, happy. I really do. I really think that's going to happen. Uh, Grim, thanks, man. Hope you're having a great day too, buddy. What's up, Wesley? You know the answer. What's up, Scott? Nerd of the Rings? We all pumped to have a Star Wars Theory trailer breakdown, too? Yeah, eventually, once we get a trailer. I can't break this. There's nothing to break down. I mean, I'm sure there's going to be channels that make the, like, 10 Easter eggs video on this, but that's just kind of... Why? Um, only money. Twin Sons, thank you, man. May the Force be with you, too. A leaker named... Said it's out soon. What's out soon? Uh, do you guys want to watch the Boba Fett stuff? I mean... Okay, you know what? Um, go to my gaming channel, Theories Arcade. Go to Theories Arcade. Subscribe. Um, I'm going to do a uh, reaction to the actual footage. I'm going to try to find it on like... Uh, the most wholesome app in the world, Twitter. And then we can do like a watch party there too, but I'm not done here yet. You haven't seen the last of me. Raining. They need to absolutely nail the dialogue during the Vader Kenobi fight. The amazing dialogue of the OG fight in Revenge of the Sith gave me major goosebumps. Yeah, I think they will. You know, I mean, Dave Filoni's on this. Dave and John, so they're overseeing everything. So I believe they'll have uh, a lot of say, and they'll do a really good job. Thanks, Zek. I need to enlarge in your guys' chat, because I am going blind, because I'm old. Um, we all feel the same. The boys are back. They're back. The leakers of the trailer for Kenobi is coming out tonight with Bad Batch Season 2 Sizzle. What? Well, I guess I'll see you guys soon, then. Uh, I just joined. What's going on? Make sure to hit that like button, guys. We only got... Oh, did you know this? Uh, YouTube is taking away the dislike button. I talked about it on my gaming channel. I'm really unhappy about it. Not to digress too much, but... Um, I think everyone should be able to see... You know, the community should be able to see how many dislikes a video has. I want everyone to see, you know, how many dislikes my video has. Um, I think it's just censorship. You know, how they're doing that. But anyways, enough about that. So... Uh, it's like, what's the point of having a like button in that case? It's like, you can only see the likes. It's like, how do you, like a tutorial video, like, how do you know if it's trash or not, right? Or a video in general. Um, but yeah, let's try to get over 2,000 likes if we can on this vid. I don't make the rules, I just play by them. Uh, hey, Theory, just wanted to check in on you, dude. Hope you're okay and not overworking too much. Much love, Ryan GB. Hey, love you too, man. Uh, thank you for the checking in but uh yeah no i'm good i've been pacing myself if you guys haven't noticed i've been pacing myself on the channel where i just like upload you know when i feel like it and then i'm i'm saving all my all my juice for um 2022 because i know that's it's gonna be it's gonna require a lot of it's gonna require the old star wars theory work ethic you know no sleeve two three videos a day like just absolutely going am and enjoying it carly king in the chat what's up carly what's up granny dude we're tearing up at a sizzle reel imagine the actual thing i know it's because we haven't seen these characters and we, we thought they were long gone and then we're also going to be getting hayden christensen in uh ahsoka so i think it's going to be really good you love my mustache thanks I've never had a mustache. I just got bored. Um, I was hoping for Kenobi. Love you, Theory. Have a good one. Hey, you too, man. Thanks, Grand Adderall Thrawn. Hey, Theory. Just wanted to check in. Oh, yeah. I read that one. Ryan, all good, dude. So, did you guys want to watch the uh, the Boba Fett thing? 
together. Do the sleep part for higher quality videos and reactions. Oh no, dude, I, I run off uh, I run off air, man. I run off air. Pure energy. How do you think uh Yeah. It's a big cup? No, I'm just a really small person. Yeah. Okay. So let's watch. Uh, let's watch the Boba Fett thing. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. Uh, just let me know when you guys are ready, and we'll watch it. So, spam one right now, so I know you're ready, and then we can begin. And this can be kind of like a watch party hangout um, sort of thing going on. Don't die at 40. If he dies, he dies. That's how I approach life. Don't want to, but I like being alive. But, you know, you never know. <clears throat> Everyone's ready? Okay. Um, all right. Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. Can you go to my Instagram? I want to hit 300,000... Uh, followers. I'm at 298 right now. So I just need 2,000 more. Whoa. What's up, Star Wars Fantasy? I agree, man. Man, I wish they released this on YouTube. Oh. What's up, Chosen Few? Sending you love from BK, New York. You mentioned in the theory Anakin arrested and satisfied. Because Padme lived, my question is, how would they secure him knowing he's powerful? How would they secure him? What do you mean? How would they secure him? Oh, the fan fiction. Well, you can contain someone in jail. In, in jail. Ray shields, but he breaks out.
Yo, Cooper Sellers, good question. Um, I'll answer it at the end. I don't think so. I don't think it's the same thing at all. But... Thanks, Tyler. I think we're going to get that. Vader hunting Jedi in his prime. I think we're about to get it. George never felt like you have to give him a backstory. <laughs> the hell? Yo, I, dude, I'm getting like watch party vibes, man. I can't wait. I can't. Just do watch parties with you all again. Jeez, man. It's gonna be great.
cool, man. It was really beautiful, man. You know, it's been so long since we've had footage like this. It's like a year. It feels like a really long time. So much has changed in a year. Oh, wow. That's so cool, man. How they're shooting this.
<laughs> cool. Hmm. That's a crazy collection, man. Jeez. Sansweet has everything, hey? <laughs> you literally got everything. I remember these. I remember those things. The tap dancing things. Oh, crazy. He has the freaking rocket firing one. That's nuts. Those never went into production. <laughs> it's like a kid, like, shoots his eye out with the rocket. Probably, man, they'd probably get sued. What? Jeez. We gotta we gotta finish the uh, bounty hunter game and Republic Commando.
Oh, what do you know what fans want? Cool. It was great. It's awesome seeing Boba come back like that, you know? It was a really nice uh, little documentary. Loved it. Loved it. It's wild, dude. And it's actually here. It's really heartwarming that they're bringing back all the, uh, <clears throat> the you know, the prequel characters, OG characters. Bring it back to Moore Morrison, you know, they're bringing back Hayden Christensen, Ewan McGregor. I'm wondering if, uh, gonna bring back Natalie Portman somehow but um everyone in the chat can't wait for watch parties yeah me neither man um do you think we'll get to see Kenobi take down some inquisitors oh absolutely I think we'll we might even see Vader take down some inquisitors Maybe, like, an Inquisitor is about to fight Kenobi, and Vader's just like, no, he's mine, and just kills the Inquisitor. Uh, do you think there will be the ones we know, or the new ones? Probably ones that we know, I think. And maybe some new ones, too. What if Boba builds his criminal empire to gain power to become the new ruler of Mandalore? I don't think he cares about Mandalore. I would like to see how Mando and Bo-Katan react to that. I, yeah, I don't think he cares. I don't think Mandalore is on his radar. What's up, Tyler? Right, so Cooper, um, so the Force Scream that Palpatine did was actually like a Sith Force Scream, and it pierced through the Force itself at all of the uh, at all the Jedi in the room, and it disoriented them, and that's one of the reasons why they were like, Whoa. not to mention he was super fast. So uh, that Force Scream actually, it wasn't just for show. Um, I kind of wish they made it like a little more piercing when they edited the the actual uh, movie. Because then you'd be like, oh, okay, I kind of understand. Uh, Sub Theory, always love your work and dedication to the channel. One thing I've always wanted to see was Vader in his prime hunting the Jedi. Me too, and I think we'll get it. Uh, Danielle, thank you for being a new member. Mr. Book says, do you think Starkiller could show up in the show? Probably not. He's too powerful. He's too powerful to be left alive. What's up, Charlie? As always, General Theory, you rock, brother. Can't wait to watch parties begin. Meeting Rosario Dawson tomorrow for GalaxyCon. I will ask her to give you a shout out. <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> Don't do that. Um, that'd be nice, but I don't want to put her like in a in a weird spot because I don't know if I don't know. It's a different discussion for a different time. Um, but hey, that's awesome that you get to meet her. Hey, theory. I haven't been able to catch the streams lately, but still loving the content. By the way, the screen is black to us. Yeah, so um, whenever it plays, Disney has some sort of like encoder or like safety thing that uh, whenever you play it, it shows black so that you can't copyright their material. And there are shows. But I figured, you know, I just put it on there so you guys can see the watch time. <laughs> the um, play time. What's up, Noah? Love your stuff, Theory. You think we'll get to see Kenobi take down some Inquisitors? Yup. Definitely. What if Book of Boba builds his criminal empire to gain power and become the ruler of Mandalore? Uh, they adding Boba Fett and Fennec to Fortnite December 24th? Jeez. It's a big payday, I guess. Um, what's up, Brenda? He needs a blunt of that fire OG. It's this fallout. Utini! Says Michael. Disable hardware acceleration in your browser and the black screen will go away. Maybe, but I don't want it to go away because my channel would get struck. Keep up the great content. Much love from Australia. Thanks, Big Gus. Big, Big Jesus. Captain Trek is a new member. And so is This Is The Way. Oh, no, new member is uh, just Captain Trek. This Is The Way is a nine-month member. Thanks, man. What do you think about Darth Maul animated series rumors and how you could feel about this show? Okay, a Darth Maul animated series would be amazing. I want them to make the Darth Maul game. But also, uh, how do I feel about this show? What, Kenobi or Boba? 
I'm more excited for Kenobi than I am for Boba, but I'm I'm like if Kenobi is like a 11 out of 10, Boba is like a 10 out of 10. So I'm very excited for Book of Boba. I think it's going to be one of the most cool shows for sure. Bro, we can't see anything. The screen is black. Yeah. Hey, Theory, any updates on your Saber release? Oh, yes. Uh, so we are pretty much at the last step. Um, I'm going to show you guys something right now. Uh, where is it? Right here. So, so for paint, um, and, and I'm going to make a video on this too, but it's a little too early, but I'm just going to answer you real quick. So for paint, we were looking at a bunch of different paints and stuff like that for the hilt. Uh, this is, we're going through a bunch of different ones. And I said, you know what? Something that I haven't seen done before is a pearlescent paint. You know, we, we've seen metallic, we've seen black, we've seen this and that. But a pearlescent paint is something that, I mean, I love cars. I, I, I am, you may not know this, but I really love cars. Cool cars, fast cars, trucks, whatever. I always have. Pearlescent paint is pretty damn cool looking, but like maybe like a almost like matte kind of pearlescent paint. So we came up with this. He sent me a picture of that. That kind of paint. That's not my car. Um... So we're actually going to do something like that. And we've landed on that. Now it's just about um, the three of us meeting. So me, the head of development, uh, and uh, um, sorry, head of manufacturing, and Mark. So we're going to meet us on a Zoom call. And we're going to go over pricing and everything like that. Um, they include a standard blade. And uh, the cost also includes a RGBX kit. So... Uh, also, for my sounds, I'm trying to have everything uh, made from scratch. Uh, I know Lucasfilm doesn't care if you use their sounds, as like every single Sabre company does this, but um, Kyberphonic is actually going in and making every single Sabre sound by scratch, um, uh, from scratch. So they will be, you know, very unique and, and you know, and mine. Um, so we'll see how it goes. But that's going to be the first one. That's going to be the first saber. And if they sell out, you know, if, if we make some money on it, then we'll go and we'll make the next batch. Um, but this will be like a one-time run kind of thing. And it'll be super limited. I think under 100 sabers for sure. We don't know yet. Maybe just 30. What if Boba... Okay, so where are we going here? It's going to be, it's, it's going to be expensive to start it up, but I think it'll be worth it. It'll be cool. Pay theory and updates during save release. I'll say if you watch Squid Game. I watched episode up to episode five of Squid Game and then I got bored. Hey Theory, would you prefer Quarter Movie Trilogy series or animated? Um, a movie trilogy. This trailer was bullcrap. Wouldn't Disney make billions by giving a Darth Revan movie or Rule of Two movie? Legends material seems criminally underutilized. I think we're leading to that, man. I think we're going to end up there someday. You know, I think they're just kind of exhausting certain avenues of Star Wars. And now you can see they're kind of going into like the spinoff shows and the backstory shows, so to speak. So I think we're going to be getting a lot of real good stuff. But it's just going to take time. I think first they really wanted the sequel trilogy to just end so that they could like focus on other things because obviously that's, you know, the thing that's unfinished and they need to focus on that the most. So I think now that that is done um, for now, unless they make a uh, 10, 11, 12, uh, they can now focus on other stuff. So, and then after these shows are done, then, you know, we're going to get the next batch. But I am a little bit disappointed as to why we didn't get, you know, like a, a lot of stuff today. Um, but, you know, we, we got the Kenobi sizzle reel, which was really nice to see, and, and the uh, Boba Fett thing. Surely you do a car reveal. I'll do a car reveal, yeah, for sure. I ordered a real sick car. Uh, it's coming in the summer. It's being built right now. So... Um, I'll definitely show you guys in the in the summer because well, you guys help me pay for it. So, to be honest, I'm not gonna hide that from you. 
I want you guys to, uh, you guys, you guys have been here since day one, man. Like, you know, when I was making this channel on a busted up iPhone five. So since Revenge of the Sith seems to be your favorite Star Wars movie, please stream the video game of PS2 emulator if you haven't played it already. Yeah, I got to set up an emulator somehow. They just brought back all the N64, not all, but the some of the big N64 games on the Switch, and I've been, I streamed it once, and I, I gotta go back and stream more. Um, especially Goldeneye, but we were playing Ocarina of Time on the gaming channel. Literally so hyped for Boba, Kenobi, can't wait for Watch Party soon to come back. Uh, need to rewatch Mando Season 2 before Boba drops. Yeah, I'm going through and I'm reading all the different comics, so as we lead up to December 29th, or sorry, December, yeah, December 29th, I'm going to be dropping probably two Boba videos every single day. And they're just going to be like different random facts videos that you guys will hopefully enjoy and, and get to know more about Boba from Legends and Canon. They're pretty valuable videos in the terms of the information in them that I'm sourcing. So if you do have time, check them out when they do come. But there will be like a Boba theme leading up to Boba and it'll just be like boom, 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 like just constant bombarding you guys with Boba which uh, I know a lot of you want. What if Vader doesn't know he's fighting Obi-Wan? Oh, dude. Come on. Uh, Darnell, thanks, man. Do you play Star Wars The Old Republic? Would love to see you collab with Star Wars Torista on the gaming channel. Uh, I do play it, but it just crashes every time I open it. So I'm waiting for the revamp, but... The only way I can play it is uh, on on StreamYards for some reason. And it, it like won't crash. We still missing the third, fourth sister brother, right? Uh, yeah, and I think we're also going to be getting the sixth in Kenobi. So. We shall see. Anything else? What are your predictions on the trailer? Uh, there shall be tears. <laughs> there shall be tears. This is uh, what I just posted on my Instagram. Oh, yo! So there's two thousand of you here. Just go to my uh, go to my IG. Help me hit three hundred. Let's see if we can do it on stream. I want to crack that three, man. Then there'd be three million subs and three million or three three million three hundred thousand on. Yeah. <laughs> he cries. He cries. But yeah, it's a good time on there. It's a good. It's the only other place where I connect with you guys other than uh, YouTube. So. Let's see if we can crack it. So this is after Fallen Order and before Rogue One. Yes, this is after Fallen Order, and the thing that confuses me here is that uh, that looked like the second sister in that concept art that they showed of her on Tatooine or like you know a desert planet somewhere. So I'm like, eh, Top Vader killed her, <laughs> you know, unless unless it's not her, but thought it, that looked like Trilla to me. Hmm. Who the heck said we're getting a trailer tonight and Bad Batch Season 2? Is that what you guys said? Oh, well, I guess we'll get it soon. Uh, Hayden Christian will be at Comic-Con. I'm going to tomorrow. I'm so pumped. That's cool. Is this car like your Lamborghini, which had me crying, or is this a little bigger? Is this car a little bigger? You'll have to wait and find out. I don't want to give it away. I don't want to ruin the surprise. But, uh, yeah, I think you guys will get a kick out of it. I'm excited. The artist probably just took her design as inspiration for the concept art. Uh, I don't think so. They're pretty precise on those concept arts for Star Wars. Is there a trailer today? Well, we got the sizzle reel, so you can go check it out. 
I'm glad that they at least like show this on the screen. They don't block this, but. You think Kenobi will be so powerful in the series because he'll be so emotional with his past? He taps into the dark side fighting Vader. No, I think that's one of the cool things about Kenobi is that he never goes into the dark side. And he's, just, you know, he's had a lot of shit happen to him, you know? Qui-Gon died. Anakin turned. Satine died. The Jedi Order was just dismantled and ex pretty much extinct. He had to go into hiding. He's dealt with a lot. So I like the fact that he just stays true, you know? I like Star Wars, don't get me wrong, but I'm more of a Star Trek fan. Would you be willing to talk about some Star Trek stuff? Sure, but I don't know anything about Star Trek. If you want to watch the Obi-Wan teaser so we can see, go over, go onto YouTube and search for Kenobi trailer, and it's the first one. By the way, love the vids, keep it up. Okay, well, I'm going to go do that on the gaming channel right now. So if you guys want, go there. Theories Arcade, and uh, I'm going to do a reaction, quick reaction with you all. Do you remember the Republic Comics action figure pack that came with the comic that had Quinlan Vos surviving Order 66 and killing Com Commander Faye? No, don't. I don't. Yeah, I left Star Trek. I like Star Trek too. I used to watch it when I was a kid with my dad, but um, never got as into it nearly as into it as Star Wars. I would just watch it when it was on TV. It was relaxing. A theory eleven. The content disappointed today. Not seeing a Kenobi trailer. Wake up and smell the coffee. Disney love from Ireland. Hey, cool. I got to see Ireland someday. You know, when the world goes back to normal, hopefully I can uh, come and see all you guys. Give you all a hug. Give you all a handshake. So. Especially in the UK. I know there, there's a lot of you in the UK. My biggest demographic is uh, USA, UK, and uh, what's the other one? Is it Germany? Or is it Australia? Or is it Canada? I don't know. That's the top five, though. I think. Or maybe it's changed now. Who knows? It always changes. <sighs> Is my dad still alive? Yeah, thankfully. He is 66. <laughs> Execute order 66. If you watch the first season of original Star Trek, you will become a fan, guaranteed. Yeah, that's the one I was watching when I was a kid. Okay, love you guys. I'm going to go on the gaming channel and we're going to react to the Kenobi uh, sizzle reel trailer uh, and I'll show it there. But if it gets striked, just know I went out with a bang. Love you. Catch you later. Oh, uh, sorry, I see, I see Jay sent a super chat. Hey, Theory, do you think we'll see Maul and Kenobi series like him and Vader both hunting down Obi or possibly fight each other? Thoughts? Um, I think we could see, see Maul. Yeah, absolutely. Definitely. Yeah, that'd be sweet. All right, later.